what's up guys this is the uh, Bruce Bros um, 239 and we're coming at you today with a scorpion hanger which actually took me about a day to build um, I really wanted to build something that could hold a vehicle or multiple and um, I came up with this and it's actually about it takes up a whole entire grid base plate if that gives you an idea how many pieces are in this thing um, I'm gonna guess a few thousand um, but so yeah, let's jump into this. So at the top we have the Pelican on the landing pad. Um, you guys have seen this in previous videos. Or for those of you that are not, go and check out the other videos to see them. So that's a Pelican. Um, we have some guys up here. Um, one of the guys from the new Mystery series, the white Mark IV armor. Buck, sniping. And I honestly don't know who this Spartan is. Um, so here's the roof. This is like the spot for where the pelican lands. Um, so you want to take off. Here's what I have to clip these down. It's actually only held down the roof by four different studs. Um, before we take that off, I want to show you guys the door, which actually took me a while to figure out and get all the kinks out. So this is the door. Um, yeah, look in there. That's it, It's huge on the inside. I mean, it, it's just... It's kind of intimidating at first whenever you just see the doors open and you see all these people. Um, so then you take the roof off, and the roof is made of a bunch of pieces. And then you got the inside. So this is the only thing really that was made by Mega Box or Lego. Um, this is the Scorpion. Um, I did a review on the Scorpion Stink set previously. If you haven't seen that, please check that out. Um, we also have. Spartan Scout over here. He's this is like a little thing to open up and close the doors and whatnot, control things. Um, I'm gonna do something about these little clips up here probably. Um, so yeah, we get into this. We have some more guys from the new mystery series. We have a ladder that goes up here. Um, we have this guy. He's pretty cool. Uh, I think he's an ODST Marine. Um, this is kind of like a weapon rack. See, I have some Technic pins. Holding weapons. Uh, not too much going on in here. Didn't feel it was necessary to put too many weapons on here. Just kind of like give a generalization. Um, you have the up top. So there's a second level. And the bottom, as you can see, it can hold two scorpions side by side. Um, there's a little fuel pump right there. I figured I might as well put that in there. Just for a little bit of character. Um, you can fit two scorpions. A um, bunch of mantises. Actually made... A mantis that I'm probably going to show you guys soon. Um, homemade mantis. You probably fit about four or five of those in here. Um, a few warthogs could probably fit in here. Um, the overall size of this thing is it's just huge. You could stack up over here. We have Buck, Spartan Buck. You could probably stack up two of him on top of each other until you get to the second layer. That's how big this thing is. Um, a bunch of basic bricks in it. As you can see all the basic bricks made this wall. Um, He's tall, one by f six by fives are really, really helpful in this project. Um, I actually went to the Lego store and bought some more of those the other day, and I made a video about the parts haul, if you want to check that out. So, yeah, this is the outside. One more look at it. The door's massive. So yeah, that's the scorpion hanger. Um, just remember to please follow, like, subscribe. If you have any comments, please leave them below. Um, going to be a bunch more stuff coming at you guys. And Brick Bros out.